What'd they say? Is she sure in all right? Well, <clears throat> she's in the emergency room, and uh, Eva's working on her right now. Well, thank God. But uh, there's a complication, though. She passed out as soon as they got there, and uh, she hasn't come to. Why not? They don't know. Damn it. Why, why would somebody do this to Sheridan? She does not deserve this. She has been through too much already. It is just so unfair. Wait a minute. You know, what if the person who set the fire wasn't after Louise and Sheridan? What are you talking about? Well, this is the Crane estate, after all. I mean, what if the arsonists just, they didn't know who lived here, and they just wanted vengeance on any Crane? Yeah, my family's heard enough people. There's an understatement. That's why I'm trying to change the Crane image, so that my son will be able to hold his head high as he grows up. You know, right now, the Cranes are despised by just about everybody in Harmony. I still don't understand how something like this could happen to the people we love. I'm, I'm gonna go back to the main house. If uh, someone has a vendetta against the cranes, they, they could go after little Ethan. All right, you look, you should call security for some added protection, okay? Okay. All right. Good idea, sweetheart. Let's go. Are you guys coming? No, no, I'm taking Whitney home. It's been a long night. Whitney, can I uh, talk to Chad for a sec? Sure. Thanks. Well, looks like, uh,. One good thing happened out of tonight's disaster, huh? Yeah, I hope so. Nothing would make me happier. Good luck. And I want to schedule a press conference here at the mansion first thing in the morning. <laughs> I know it'll knock people's socks off, and that's the point. <sighs> Is there a problem? Um, I'm not sure. Teresa, Teresa, I find it. Very noble what you're doing with the crane money. I think what my half-brother's trying to say is that you might as well be painting a big red bullseye on your forehead. What are you talking about? I'm, ta I'm talking about the same thing we were talking about earlier. You're a prime target for Julian and Rebecca. You guys, please. I could handle those two clowns in my sleep. I know exactly what I'm doing. Me to send a few million to the Alzheimer's Association in the morning in memory of my grandmother. That's an um, admirable impulse, Teresa, really it is, but um, you may want to reconsider. Why should I? Julian and Rebecca look way too happy right now. <laughs> it's as if they found some way to stop your charitable contributions or something. Will you guys just stop? I know what I'm doing. If anything, I should give it away faster. Yes, is this guy dogs for blind? I'd like to make a donation. I was thinking 10, uh, no, no, let's make it 20,000 even. 